Earlier, I got a call from a guy selling a custom motorcycle. So me and my dad are on our way to go check it out. What in the hell do we have here? <laughs> a uh, totally custom-made trike. Do you put a costume on when you ride it? Like you're a superhero <laughs> or something? I called the guys down to check out my custom 2005 trike. I need to put my car in the garage because it takes up all the space. I've got 100000 in it. I'd like to get 50000 This is something, man. Uh, did you build this yourself? I had it custom built. We have a 350 stroker engine. And we have speakers here, here, and in the headrest. And we have a Mack truck horn that'll get their attention if they're not already staring at you. It's definitely a, uh, attention a getter. chick magnet. <laughs> it's definitely long, I'll tell you that. It's a little difficult to ride, I imagine. Easy as pie. I mean, it's fully automatic. It's just like driving a car. A lot of older guys like to ride them. Um... They're a lot safer than motorcycles. They want the experience of riding a motorcycle, but they don't want to be on two wheels. How much did you pay for this thing? I've got about 100000 in it. <sighs> You've got $100,000 in this? Approximately. It's crazy how much cash people sink into their custom projects. And I get it. I've got a custom bike, and I love it. But some people just get carried away. So, but how much were you looking to get out of it? The lowest I'd want to go would, would be about 50. Buddy, I am by no means a trike expert. Let me call my buddy Danny in. He owns a custom motorcycle shop. He builds bikes for a living. He can give me an idea of what it would cost to build something like this. We'll go from there. OK, sounds good. I don't see 100 grand here or even 50. But if Danny says there's money to be made, I'll consider making an offer. What's up, gents? The guys always call me whenever they have questions on basically an interesting vehicle. Today, a hot rod trike. This is definitely an outrageous version of the old school trikes. Trikes have been around since the beginning of bikes. There's always been a purpose. The meter maids writing tickets, or the ice cream man with the trike. As time has gone by, man, we've evolved into crazy things like this. The guy's in it 100 grand. I want to know, if I went in and I said oh, I want this trike, what would it cost you to build me one? Let me take a closer look at it. You know, when it comes to customizing or personalizing, trikes are just like anything else out there, man. The sky's the limit. You can go as crazy as you want. OK, we're looking at a 383 stroker motor. It's got aluminum heads. That always makes it nice. You've got a turbo 350 transmission behind it. These are Roadster side pipes. You see these on 32 Fords. Got a lot of nice looking, you know, diamond plate work on it. It gives a little flash. It's got a nice big, you know, killer stereo system in it. That's cool. There's some decent components on this thing that I would use on a hot rod situation. Hey, brother, can you fire it up? Sure. All right. You've got a, a tick over here. It could be as minor as adjusting a lifter on it. All right, so what do you think, Danny? Well, you know, it's uh, it's got a lot of cool bells and whistles on it. You know, in today's market, resale right now is soft. Between all the components sitting here, I'm seeing about 15 grand. I, I turned down offers double that. You should have taken it, brother. No. You should have taken it. No. You can buy this frame right now online for two Gs. You can buy that rear end right now a grand. The list goes on and on. There is roughly fifteen to $18,000 worth of components here. Maybe there's another 10, 12 grand worth of labor and time in it. There's just no way with all the money I put in there. Brother, I believe you. If you're having a blast with it, that's all that matters, that you're having fun with it. I'm just saying what's really here. Well, Danny, my man, thanks for coming by. Absolutely. To me, the lesson to be learned here is do a little bit of research before you whip out that checkbook. Here's what I honestly see, my man. For lack of a better term, I think they fleeced you because there is absolutely no reason this bike should have cost you $100,000. You paid as much as this is a brand new Maserati cost. That's so your your price is what he came up with, 15? No, no, I wouldn't even pay that. That's what we're, that's what we're assuming we could sell it for in this market. I'd give you like 10 grand. Yeah, that's uh, I don't think so. Okay. The lowest I'd want to go would would be about 50. I just think you're in it really really deep and you're going to have to think about maybe cutting your losses. Cutting losses is one thing. But Giving it away is another. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Have a good one, man. <laughs> I'm trying. 
We couldn't come to a deal that I could live with today. I know there's a recession, but there are still people with money, and they still are buying expensive toys. They're still out there.